Hey guys, it's Corey from Slash Gear. Today I have a quick video here to show us a little bit more of the new AT&T 4G powered LG Nitro HD smartphone. I'm going to quickly shut that off. Again, this is the LG Nitro HD available on AT&T as of yesterday. It has uh, 4G LTE speeds, impressive specs all around. This is a top quality phone from uh, AT&T and LG. Um, just we'll, Showed you plenty in the hands-on, but I'm going to show you a little bit more um, detail the the hardware and then get into the software a little bit just for an idea to those looking to purchase. We have a 4.5 inch display with a True HD IPS display panel at 1280 by a 720p HD resolution. It looks great outside. It's quite impressive. We have a dual core, uh, 1.5 gigahertz Qualcomm processor, one gig of RAM. Uh, we have 16 gigabytes of internal storage as well as 16 gigabyte uh, micro SD card included. 8 megapixel camera on the rear, 1.3 uh, front facing camera, and a nice hard coating on the, the back. It's got a fat 1830 mAh battery, should last plenty long. It's thin, it's sleek, but uh, we saw plenty of it in the pictures. So for now I'm just going to really quickly show us the software a little bit just for those interested, someone that might be planning to purchase it. So uh, let's get into that real quick. Here it is, here's the home screen. Everything's pretty smooth, pretty quick, pretty stable. It is an AT&T phone, so as usual we have, well let's see, some AT&T family apps and barcode scanners and AT&T Navigator. I don't know if you can see that on screen. But uh, that's about it. We do have a Zynga Poker HD for that HD screen. That's not available in the market from what I could see. Um, unless, you know, you have to have an HD screen to HD phone to actually search for it. But uh, they have three capacitive buttons down below. The menu button is actually the search button too if you long press that. I don't like when they turn off it's it's kinda hard to see them. You can see that here in a minute. They're almost invisible and then once you touch the screen they you know they light up again for you. But um, we, we've seen plenty from uh, LG before so a lot of this isn't extremely new but this was just kind of a rundown video for those interested. They have some widgets up top to quickly toggle, you know, Wi-Fi and Bluetooth and all that. When you add new things to the touch, you know, to the screen widgets or change the wallpapers, they have this nice little you know, gallery here to search what you want. You go into wallpapers, choose a wallpaper or a live wallpaper you'd like, and then exit that. So that's kind of uh, kind of unique and new. They do have something where you can when you go to change an app, you just move the phone and it'll move the icon where it wants to go by motion but I had a hard time controlling it to be honest so I actually disabled it. Samsung has something similar that actually worked a lot better. A little bit of a knock on uh, LG but it's a first try we'll give them give them a pass here. Real quick 4G LTE smartphone maybe we'll turn that on. You can see there let's see if you can see that on video we got 15 before it's pretty quick pretty impressive this is the AT&T 4G LTE here in my uh, area in Las Vegas. Just give it a quick run. As you can see, flies pretty quick. That's upload speed right there. AT&T's definitely stepped that up. Almost 13 down, 5 up. That's better than, better than a lot that uh, we've seen from others. Pretty fast 4G speeds. As you can see, everything's really quick, everything's smooth. Let's see what we can show you here. Go into the settings. Everything's pretty similar. We have Android 2.3.5. You can see that on video. But the screen's a super IPS display with uh, you know the 1280 by 800. It looks really good. It looks great outside. Like I said, you know, a minute ago. Let's see if we can kind of adjust the volume for you here, or not volume, the brightness. It gets really bright, really crisp. Uh, Maybe, maybe a little, a little uh, cold on the colors, but overall it's it's an impressive screen, and I don't really have any complaints. It's very crisp. That uh, HD resolution looks really good. I haven't tried the Galaxy Nexus or some of those other high resolution phones, but uh, this definitely is impressive to say the least. But don't want to waste too much time here. Just a quick look at the new LG Nitro HD with 4G LTE thanks to AT&T. There it is. Thanks for watching guys.